trying to break out of this, this slide a little bit, you get a chance against a rival, what would it mean uh, just to get back on, on the winning side of things after coming so close in a couple uh, of these games? A win would be great uh, for all of us, I think, confidence-wise, too, with our guys. Uh, you know, we played very hard, and I think we've competed, and we're getting better. And uh, I think I've seen some huge strides with a lot of guys on this team, and now we just got to put it together for 40 minutes. And not a lot of margin for uh, error in this uh, conference. And uh, But you know what? Our guys have practiced well. Uh, I still love the mentality of these guys. And, uh, you know, we still got a lot to play for, and we just got to focus on this next game. How much do you look forward to the rivalry? I mean, having your in-state rival in conference. Yeah, year. I think it's great. It's great for the school, and uh, I got a lot of respect for Stan Heath. You know, he's he's done a great job there, and and I know they've had to battle. You know, with their point guard being out and some injuries, it's hurt their team. They got some great young players, but the rivalry is great for the school, and it's obviously great for the league, and uh, it's great for our program as well. How, how much with this being a rivalry game will this help focus the guys on trying to get that losing streak snapped? Yeah, well, you know, I think our guys are, you know, they're really focused on, you know, who the next game is. I mean, obviously, I think they. They've embraced the rivalry a little bit. I don't know if they realize the impact of it uh, because really now it's starting to be a rivalry with the first year in the conference. But uh, our guys are just really trying to, to get better every day. You guys have been asked to play different roles, to do different things. You came off the, the bench the other night to, to spark this team against a very good Louisville team. Can you just talk about the adjustments that have had to happen from everyone within the locker room to try to get this, this thing going? I think Coach is just trying to um, figure out what works right now. I think we had a little rough patch. And I think, you know, one thing we've been playing hard and competing, but, uh, you know, just being, you know, a senior, being a leader, you know, you just got to do whatever Coach asks you to do and be ready, you know, to do it. With the USF coming to town, you guys excited about the blackout and having all the students in the crowd out there? Oh, definitely, definitely. Anytime we get to play against them, it's always, you know, fun. And, you know, um, you know, campus seems to, you know, just light up that night. And, you know, you know I know it's going to be a packed house and everybody's going to come out and support. So I'm really excited. Hey, night fans, come support us February 5th as we take on USF for our blackout game. Go Knights and charge on.